I'm Gwendolyn with iFixit, and today I'm reassembling the iPhone 5S. I have a few tips and tricks for you today, but I strongly recommend you refer to the step-by-step -step guide appropriate to your repair when you're doing your reassembly. For example, if you're working on the display assembly, pull up that guide at iFixit.com and follow it in reverse. Let's get started. First, we're gonna get started by adding the lightning cable assembly back in the rear case. Next up is the upper component cable. I found that it's much easier to reinstall if you start by connecting your power sleep button bracket and then adhere it to the rear case. With that finished, we can work on the vibrator. After the vibrator, we can move on to laying the battery in the phone. Now let's move on to the rear camera bracket. Next up, I'm going to install the logic board. If you have removed your rear camera as well, wait until the logic board is back in place to reinstall it. It's just a little easier that way. With the logic board and rear camera in place, we can now reinstall the SIM card. Easy enough. Now we can move on to the battery connector bracket.
First step to reassembling your display assembly is the LCD shield plate. With that plate installed, we can now move on to the home button assembly. The home button is installed, and now it's time to move on to the front-facing camera and sensor cable. Now we can move on to the earpiece speaker and bracket. With both pieces of the phone complete, we can move on to attaching them. All the display assembly cables are connected, so let's move on to adding the bracket. Now we can reattach the home button cable, add the bracket, and close the phone. And that's our reassembly. You can find me on Twitter at Gwendolyn Gay and follow iFixit at iFixit. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on all our latest teardowns and repair videos. You can give us a like on Facebook at facebook.com slash iFixit.